Hi everyone! Hey! Welcome back! Um, how can I, or how do I, honor my husband or my wife? How do I honor my spouse? Okay ladies, so a few ways you could honor your husband praying for him right because when it is you there's something about praying faithfully for your husband you yourself just seem to get more patient and forgiving and joyful and grace filled you know there's just just something about praying for your husband that causes change change in the way you see him change in the way he behaves because we might have a problem with a way they are but that's not our job to change them get that right it's not your job to change your husband's behavior mindset anything like that this is not your job your job is to pray for him right and god will do the rest number two believe in his capabilities as a man <laughs> right so let your husband know that you believe in his talents and his skills and you're supportive of him and encourage him i mean it's 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 the most meaningful thing that a wife could do because let me just a secret most times your husband actually care about your opinion be his his number one fan praise him i just call roland um macgyver because roland always looking for something to build or fix or something and he does make it work with whatever he have <laughs> you know so as he's macgyver right um so 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 praise him praise his talents and believe in his capability check your tone ladies i'm gonna just back a little bit here now as ladies as women we tend to show what we think in either on our face or in our body language you need to check your tone a voice all right the body language everything you need to make sure that it demonstrates honor right always 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 your body language your tone of voice must always honor your husband stop rolling your eye <laughs> right and it's, it's okay to disagree but you don't need to show your displeasure in the disagreement just be normal it's okay to disagree you know and as we said before you know there's no need to convince the other person you know you just state your case he states his case okay we don't use that word compromise at all and you know don't do something or, or keep any past argument to try and strengthen your new argument right that's unnecessary it's uncalled for right if you're forgiving him forgive him let's move on he was at a hundred before they argue he dropped a 20 you forgive him you know where he gone a hundred why because you forgive him right you're, you're forgetting all what he did before all what he said before and we're going forward right it's unnecessary so ladies watch your tone of voice right another thing is to praise him you know tell him thanks it's 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 always the the easiest way to show appreciation you know stop criticizing and and trying to compare him to others like well brother so and so the girl and so and he don't dress like that and how come you do and that man in the movie <laughs> stop it you need to stop it all right find ways to build him up especially in front of people all right find ways to, to build him up make him feel confident within himself whether he's confident or not as i say they need us <laughs> right we didn't get married because 
I don't need you, you don't need me. Putting this thing together and uh, you need to just build him up and appreciate him for everything that he does, right? Another thing is to serve him, right? I know all you might hear serve and all you'll be like, I don't know, stay if I know nobody, mama. <laughs> That's not it, right? Serving him, I, I honestly find joy in serving Roland and it's not because of Roland per se, it's because I know if I serve in God, may be real, I'll be serving my husband because the Bible talks about your role as a wife. Right? So serve him. You know, and it's 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 always a humbling thing. And why I say serve God and then you, you, you automatically serve him is because it doesn't go for only if your husband do this for you or treat you nice or say something nice you serve him you praise him you know no that's not your job that's not your duty that's not your role as a wife i'll leave the scriptures <laughs> right you are supposed to honor your husband find the light in him tell him thanks you know show your appreciation for everything that he's been doing let him feel it's okay and let him know that it's okay to feel you know i have you i got your back we're going to dust off and we're going to move forward right don't make him feel worse than he already feeling because he feel right build him up praise him be his number one cheerleader his number one supporter have his back you know so i hope those things will work you know that's just my little advice for you wives and those aspiring to be wives you know um don't just look at the examples around that you've seen because it's not always the right ones right read the word you know seek godly counsel and take some of this advice that i'm giving you right so I'm gonna get Roland back and we're going to finish all these questions. Thank you guys again for having the patience. Thank you for the love. Mm -hmm. Thank you for the encouragement. You know, um, for us to continue to make videos with good content, you mm -hmm. know, that could be um, received by you guys. All right, much love from us and um, we thank you all. Yeah, and blessings, you know. <laughs> all right, so see you. Bye. Yeah. Bye.